endlessly searching for an original I still haven't found my King Dedede one, by the way. So, hold on. Uh, nope, it's not down there. Okay, it's officially gone. My lovely King Dedede is officially gone, and that's annoying me. But I did find one more. Oh, no, there we go. Oh, that's where Nico so, had it. our fates and our paths cross once again. Fleur de la Reine, made of Merine, also known as Diamond Lilies, I think. The name Nerine is derived from the Nereids, or Sea Nymphs. Quite appropriate for this city. Luca? Will you quit calling me that? I'm not a pet, or a cat! Oh wait, you... said Luca. Not used to that. How are you, Bayonetta? No matter where I am, you always know how to make an entrance. Nice glasses. Oh, these? <laughs> Rodan has a soft spot for Shinshu Sake from Japan. It was an easy trade to get him to make these for me. And don't get it twisted, Bayonetta. I'm not stalking you. This time, at least. <laughs> Look, I know you've got nothing but secrets. Hell, that goes for anyone, right? But if there's one thing I've learned in my line of work, it's when I found you, I found the story. What on earth are you on about this time? Don't act dumb with me. You know the story better than anyone. The Umbra Witches and the Lumen Sages, two clans that wielded incredible power just 500 years ago. The clans of the Overseer, watching over us all with the eyes of the world. The power to govern light and darkness. But now I know that there really was an Overseer. And this Overseer is the one who created the eyes of the world for humanity. The same ones that the clans held on to so hard. The Overseer was the true creator. The true god of the human realm. The god of chaos. The god of chaos? From what my research has told me, that god used to live right here in Noatu. That's why this place has gateways to each realm of the Trinity of Realities. La Porta del Paradiso, the doorway to heaven, and La Porta del Inferno, the real gates of hell. <gasps> Listen, I heard about John. Squirrels get all the nuts. You're a lucky little fella, huh? Never took you for an animal lover, Bayonetta. What can I say? I took a liking to one of the locals. So he's your little tour guide, huh? Look, I know this isn't the time to chat. Let me see what I can find out to help you. Just don't stick your nose where it doesn't belong, Cheshire. Don't you worry about my nose. I can smell trouble when I see it. You just take care of yourself. <sighs> that man's a dumbass. Also, I found the fucking Thamibo. Miko had it. Miko put it under the bed. But let's look at her costume right now. Or not. 
We have a very lovely Bayonetta. Looking like she should be in one of Akabar's games. In this lovely little outfit. I do so much love the design work in this series. Aw, Kitty! I will always love Bayonetta's design. In fact, one of the girls kind of was... Her design work was based a little bit off of Bayonetta's design. It should be fairly obvious which girl kind of acts and is styled a bit like Bayonetta. It'll become a more apparent when she makes her introduction in one of the upcoming issues of the comic. Wait, which one was that? Oh, well, I forgot how to do weapons. Shit. That was my bad. I need to play this game more than a week. In more than weekends. Holy crap, I'm bad. Got it. Oh. I really need to play this more. Oh, she would be amazing in Star Channel. I don't know if Akabar actually likes her, though. That's a good question I should ask him. I would think he does. I feel like he, he would like Bayonetta. I'll have to ask him next time I talk to him, which will probably be tonight, because i got to send him some videos. I did some more videos for next week. So, or, well, this week coming up, so I gotta send it to him. Fucking love it. I still want her glasses. I want to wear her glasses. Still gotta pick them up eventually. Now that somebody found them. I would totally wear them on stream. Be that sexy glasses girl that you all love so much. Remember, guys, my birthday is coming up next month. Hi there, sexy. In Rapture. I'ma kill it. I'ma kill it. I'm gonna end its suffering. Oh, right, that does that. There we go. Still gotta get used to this. Oh yeah, it's gonna hurt, baby. I'll take that. Now that was fun. Yeah, everyone's just like, what the hell is going on? How are those people not freaked out? I don't know. I'd be running the other way. They kind of get freaked out. Just not enough. Maybe they're used to shit exploding. I do like, look at that, that's actually really nicely designed. Hmm. Let's see if there's any secrets around here, because I'm not sure if there is or not. What do we have here? Did we find a secret? I think we might have. Hmm, two ways to go. Let's see where this leads, dead end. Alright, good. Nope, you come back here. You're mine. You don't get to escape. 
Not sure if I... Ooh. Nice. Witch's heart. All pieces fit together to form a witch's heart. We got another secret. By the way, how does the stream look? I've been ta uh, tinkering again with the uh, settings. Does it look really nice? It's supposed to be 60 frames per second. So does it work? I set it for I uh, tinkering with ultra low latency and uh, trying to get 60 frames. Okay, so this is the way we came from. So we want to get this way. God damn it! Get back here! I didn't mean to press that. Oh, I see something right there. Let's see. Rules of nature. I think the Switch version of this game did make new costumes. Oh, good. No matter the, pro the prosperity that modern technology brings, or the semblance of order civilization affords us, we can never truly overcome the power of nature. 500 years ago, a massive disaster renewed the fear of nature into the civilization of Natum. A giant tsunami is said to have nearly swallowed the town whole. The cause of this whole remain this whole this way remains shrouded in mystery. One theory postulates an underwater eruption, whatever it was. The truth was swept to the bottom of the ocean along with the rest of the city. You never you would never think it's it looking you never think it looking at the really it looking really really this is a mainstream game really at the gentle waves that now brush the shore but apparently whirlpools formed in the bay for some time after tsunami swallowing ships and people alike all right that's it You would never think it's comma looking at. Think. Did I miss a comma or am I just blind as a bat? Because either is actually true. What's wrong? Was my bad. There we go. God damn it, get back here. You are not escaping me, no matter how much you try. a witch or a sage for that matter pull off something like that <laughs> come on love y you think i'm just going to tell you my secrets when i don't even know whose side you're on all right it seems i can control the remembrance of time that's a big deal here it seems i mean no i got nothing else to say love the remembrance That you're looking at right let's go I've got a party and I've no intention of being late umbrin crow I think I might have missed one or two we're not going for a hundred percent so it's not a big deal Path of the Chosen. 
While checking for leads at the town library, I spied an old wall print between dusty volumes. The ancient print depicts the sacred mountains, Fimbuleventer, and long corridors emerging from the summit. The path leads through the Cathedral of Cascades, terminating in a tall tower within the city. If accurate, this print confirms that while the tower is a shadow of its former glory, at one time there was a path from town leading directly to the mountain's peak. Nothing too groundbreaking about that, but the next mural I found was harder to swallow, to say the least. It showed people walking directly up the walls of the aforementioned spire. I thought the sea air might have gone to my head, but no matter how I looked at it, the truth was plain to see. There was a pre perpendicular parade going up the tower. Were these the chosen one I had heard about so much? Were these the chosen few who could walk the path to the god waiting atop Fimbulavunter? I have no idea how to say that word. Well, this is going to be our last game for today. Then I've got to go do my own things. You bitch! You ruined my fun. You're getting what you deserve. There we go. Hammer time. Oh, it looks like we're getting a new weapon. Kid, go fuck yourself. I'm going to gra go grab that weapon. Angelic Hymn, Golden LP, William Tell Overture. I was hoping for halos, but I'll take this. I keep doing that by accident because of where the buttons are. I get to go for a ride. Yeah. Ride my pony. Nice. So let's grab that. And I got a lovely new hammer. Oh, so nice. I'm sure you guys want Bayonetta to ride you, too. I'll take those. Is there anything over here? No, but there is this. Have fun, kid. I'm going to the shop. I have a hymn to go deliver. Another LP. No rest for the wicked, even if I am jollier than the average demon. But no need to pity me. I was bored anyways. 
Be right back. This one's gonna be fun. Been looking for a workout like this for a while. Ta-ta. They say life's a bitch. Try being dead for a couple millennia. Makes a demon cranky as shit. <laughs> Don't think this demon will be complaining anymore. Kafka. New product. Rodin's treasure. Kafka is now in stock. But first. Looks like we got a special delivery from Parts Unknown. Guess they heard about us. And wanted to help out. Ain't that sweet? Makes me want to find out whoever sent it and bust them a thankful cap in their ass. That was that was uh, that was my uh, D -D -D. Let's do one more. Hoping this one works. Present comes in a form of a dinosaur on Yoshi's Island. I hear they've got a saddle so comfortable it'll calm down even the loudest cr crying baby. They spin some crazy yarn there too, you know. It was my yarn, Yoshi. I wish you could actually look at them first. Let's see. Super Mirror. Super Mirror 64-2. Oh, we're gonna have to save up a lot for that. What do you guys think? Should we... Yeah, we should. We should absolutely save. All right, we'll save up. We'll buy one technique though. And that's it. Oh, can we use them multiple times? All right, I'll do that next time. I need to get more amiibos now just for this game. I wish I had Mario amiibos and stuff, but I don't. There we go. Somebody's waiting on me, that's why. Look at you thinking you're gonna escape me. Oh, I gotta actually put Kefka on, that's right. There we go. Let's actually put Kefka on. That's gonna be fun. That's gonna be a fun one. I think it's a Mario costume? Probably. I do know amiibos do unlock certain costumes. I'm just not sure they're amiibos. And down you go, my friend. Oh, 
Oh, you managed to hit me. Come on. You're gonna have a fun day, aren't you, Mr. Angel? Yes, you are. Are you enjoying getting it up the ass? There we go. Oh, I missed my chance of punishing him. No, I didn't. Good. Nice. Well, that was fun. Always nice to have a good climax. I'm a mature adult. Yes. Let's do this. Okay, so which one is this? Defeat all enemies only using a single combo. Okay. Is that all I'm allowed to do? Okay. Come on. Okay, you got it. Doesn't matter, got the achievement. I was afraid I was actually doing that one wrong. So after we finish Bayonetta 2, the next stream game for you guys will actually be Catherine. Like the newer Catherine game, I should say. Right, so now I gotta go this way? Isn't this the way I came from? No, then I'm going the wrong way. I'm going this way. Did I get the right? No, I think I fucked up. No, I, I'm going the right way. That ass shake. So with that, guys, we have finished off chapter two. Not bad. Unlocked. Receive a versus card. Go to tag climax to see what it is. Yeah, full body. Received. A Ooh, we have to go there and try those versus cards. While pro progressing through story mode, you will acquire special cards called versus cards. Each verse card you collect will allow you to play a new tag climax stage. More verse cards you select, the more stages you can play. Let's see the. There we go. Thank you for the goo, Condemned. Chapter 2 done. And with that, guys, I'm afraid it's time to end the stream. I'll see you guys later tonight for some Genshin Impact and some other gaming. But for now, goodbye, guys. Go relax. Go enjoy the videos up on the channel right now and i'll see you all later bye everybody and once again thank you for all your support Good night.